We are at Diamond Hill Park. I heard that they possibly changed the name to Cumberland Park. It's in Cumberland, Rhode Island. This probably isn't going to show up too well in the video, but this place is loaded with this quartz everywhere. And in the sunlight, it sparkles. It's so pretty. So I think that's how I got the name Diamond Hill. These hills are a little difficult to walk on because when you step on the rocks, they slip out because there's a lot of sand underneath, so you have to be really careful. You can see some large quartz up there. So we keep going up and up and up. This trail's not bad though because just little rocks. I don't know if my camera can pick up, but it looks like little diamonds or pixie dust in this rock. Boy, it seems like you can't go anywhere without graffiti. This used to be a ski area, and this is the part left where the ski lift was. Another hill. Because of all the trees, you can't really get the feeling of how high up we really are. I mean, it was just continuous hills like this the whole time. So this is the highest place. I'm gonna head up there. Oh, here's a morning cloak. Hi, little pretty butterfly. So this is the highest place at Diamond Hill. Every day I need to connect with nature. It's something that I do for myself. It helps me mentally, physically, spiritually, just all around makes me feel happy and at peace. It doesn't matter whether I'm in my backyard, going to the Audubon or the river, or climbing up here at Diamond Hill. It's just so wonderful. On the way down, I decided I wanted to have a walking stick because it was pretty tough getting up there slipping and sliding, so I got this stick. Actually, Chris got it. And Tanya, it's not rotted. <laughs> okay, so I made it down safely without slipping and sliding. I like my little walking stick. That's a cardinal. I can't see it, but that's my favorite bird. So you have this beautiful place. Then there's Dunkin' Donuts coffee cups. What is wrong with people? Oh, that bugs me. I hope everybody has a very good day. We'll talk to you soon.